You need a financial advisor with the freedom to focus on your specific needs. Whatever your goals, Reed Potter can create a game plan tailored to you. Call Reed at 432-0777 at Pikeville, Kentucky to learn more. Trick-or-treaters will be filling the streets of Pikeville on Halloween night, and Pikeville Police Department has some safety tips for both children and parents. Simple tips such as checking candy and driving slowly can make a big difference. Mountaintop News spoke with Pikeville PD Captain Russell Blankenship for more details. First off, before you even leave, make sure the costumes fit right. Uh, they're not too long. Uh, garments aren't maybe dragging under their feet so they don't trip and fall. Um, if possible, try to use face paint instead of mask. That way, you know, they can see better. Uh, if they are going to use a mask, if you need to, make sure the holes are big enough for their eyes to see. And uh, uh, parents, when you're out and about, make sure you're driving more cautiously that night. Uh, slow down, turn your headlights on early, make sure you can see the kids. And uh, if you want to, on their costumes, you can put reflective tape or stickers and make sure they're visible. As always, inspect the candy when they get home. Don't let them eat it before you do. Um, look for any sharp instruments like razor blades, maybe possibly a needle. Uh, sometimes some of these new drugs can look like candy, so just try to inspect to make sure it's in the original wrapping. Pikeville PD officers will also be on foot patrolling during trick-or-treat hours as an extra precautionary measure. If a child gets lost, an officer can assist them back to their parents. Uh, before you go out, make sure you talk with your kids on how to dial 911 or also what to look for. We're going to have uh, a lot of officers out tonight. We're going to saturate the streets on foot patrol. Uh, extra vehicles driving around the area. Um, so make sure they know to look for one of us. They can come to us and We'll make sure we find them, their parents. Um, also, if parents want to, they can put their name, phone number, maybe put it on a piece of paper and put it in their pocket. So if we find them, they can't find their parents, maybe we can check there and they can, we can try to call them. Uh, we always try to have extras out on patrol that night um, as many as possible because the streets get really busy. Um, we even hand out candy here at the station. Our clerk always takes care of that. Um, but we've always got several on foot patrol in Cedar Creek, um, Bowles Edition, things like that. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.